following me over to episode one. So we're going to just jump right into it because I'm pretty sure I already told you we are getting into the natural deodorant game. Okay. So like I said, if you are like me and you are the cookie monsters, um, you get all of the spam from everything that you Google, okay? So whether it be, I don't know, vacuum cleaners or cleaning supplies or energy drinks or whatever it might be, right? You're gonna get spammed and that's just how it is. So um, I get overwhelmed with all of the different options and I think, well, what if this one's better? What if this one's better? What about this? And I end up feeling like I need to try all the different brands to see which one is gonna be the best, right? Well, I'm here to save you the money and you the hassle and do it for you. So you're welcome. So um, here is my first lot of deodorants, natural deodorants. Now, um, yeah, we'll just get into it. So the first one, and the worst one. Actually, I don't know that I'll say worst. I think we have a tie in this one. So this is the pit liquor. Okay, pit liquor. Now, I got suckered into this one because um, let's talk about my BO for a minute. I used to not really have any BO. That used to not be an issue that I had until I had babies. And for some reason, my hormones went a little wacko and I now have the lovely BO. Now, it is not something that I'm proud of, but what do you do, right? So I'm, I try, like, like I, I, I don't know. It's a thing, I'm sorry, it like, yeah, it's gross. Anyway, so the ad was literally a hormonal um, woman that described my situation perfectly of um, her body odor getting horrible after pregnancy and during or during and after pregnancy. And I thought, oh my gosh, this is my answer. This is my same situation. This is me totally. So. Their concept is literally, um, it's made with, this one is made with rum. I've tried a couple. So you can see I, I gave it a fair shot, right? Like I used quite a bit of it. Um, this one was whiskey vanilla. Um, out of the two, I definitely like the vanilla one better if there's a better. So this is the roll. Um, I think you can see. So see this, like at the bottom, you can see it's like baking soda, I'm assuming. I'm not really positive. Um, but yeah, so I, I tried all of this and I thought that this was going to be a good concept because I thought that it was going to be like a, uh, like the alcohol would absorb and like really get in there and like kill some bacteria, you know, stink. It doesn't and you just kind of smell like a booze like you're just walking around smelling like you're drunk all day I don't I don't get it personally <laughs> it didn't work for me maybe it'll work for somebody else I'm not sure but it's not quite my thing like I said you're smelling like a boozy all right so then I really, really wanted to like this one, okay? This is the Young Living, can you see it? I don't know, you know, I'm new here. Anyways, this is the Young Living and it smells fantastic. It's black spruce, blue tansy, and frankincense. Okay, but the thing with this is this thing is so thick that it hurts to spread it on your armpits. Like, it is so thick. So then, obviously, it leaves like that thick, residue like feeling, like it feels thick, right? Like it's not a comfortable feeling. And then obviously, when you have a deodorant like that, then you that's when you start getting the marks on your clothes from 
like the sweat and just the deodorant marks, right? Like that yucky, like yellowy Yeah, Not good. Sorry, I'm sorry, I wanted to. Like I said, I want to, I like it. Now these two, okay. This one, so this one I got just from the good old Walmart. And it is um, a gentle deodorant hit of chamomile. I don't hate this. I didn't hate this. It was actually, it's a nice little smell. It's a nice clean scent. Um, it is It is still gonna give you kind of a little bit of that filmy fill, right? And it doesn't last no 24 hours. But it is, it is gonna give you a good day coverage, so. I'll give it that. All right, so it's an option. Ooh. Now, this one, so Modir. All right, so I do sell Modir, and I'm gonna be honest, if it totally sucked, I wouldn't even like throw it into the options, right? Like, I just <laughs> wouldn't talk about it. But it doesn't totally suck. Like, it's actually a pretty good deodorant, so it, it's a roll-on like clear liquid and it it works pretty well. I was very, very, very impressed with it, with it when I first started using it. And um, the only downfall with this is that it doesn't really have a smell. So, mm, I don't know. I personally like to have like the, I like musky smells, right? kind of thing. I don't know. That's kind of my thing. Like the men's deodorant. Personally, I really like men's deodorant smell, but apparently I'm not supposed to wear it. Anyway, so if you're looking for something with no smell, no scent, this is definitely a good one. I'm not mad at this. It is definitely only a, a day uh, deodorant. It's not going to last you more than more than your day. Um, but it is going to last you the day. So that's always good, right? All right. So that is my first little uh, haul of my deodorants. Also, I want to throw out there that I did also try the Type A deodorant. Don't waste your money on that one either because that one was really horrible. <laughs> so sorry not sorry don't waste your money i don't want you to waste your money um but uh yeah so i have currently three other deodorants that i am trying out one is looking very very promising so stay tuned and you're gonna want to know which one that is because it's good so anyways uh i did get a nice haircut today uh, had to get my my hair nice and fixed up. What is it about getting your hair done by the hairdresser? Like, that I'll never be able to have it look like this again. So next time you guys see me, it's not gonna be this pretty, I'm sure. But I love it. Thank you, Elena. Thank you, you're amazing. So, um, like this video and comment below if you have a natural deodorant that you have been using and that you're liking. Um, I will also get into like the natural deodorant transitions because I know someone's gonna say something about that. But we'll talk about that in the next one. All right, see you guys later. Bye.